today we'll be making an aquaponic system. This is similar to a hydroponic system, but there's a few differences. Instead of manually adding nutrients to the water, the waste provided by the fish gives the plants its nutrients they need to grow. The plants clean the water for the fishes, and this cycle happens over and over. This is also known as a symbiotic relationship. Aquaponic gardens are a fun and innovative way of growing food at home. So without further ado, let's get building. For this project, you will need a fish tank with fish, a hot glue gun, a pump, plastic tubing, a plastic container, a rack, growing media and some plants. Firstly, we should have our fish tank filled with water and fish. For now, place the pump to the side. Take the plastic container and make two holes in it for the tubing. One at the side at the top and one at the bottom on the opposite side. Place a small piece of tubing in the hole at the bottom and ensure that it's about one inch from the top level. Glue it in place. Place the rack and plastic container on top of the aquarium. Once it's secure, put the pump into the water and place the plastic tubing from the pump into the second hole. Glue this in place as well. This is where water will be coming in for the plants. Next, we are going to fill the plastic container with the growing media. The growing media we are using today is a combination of gravel and a crushed clay pot. Turn on the pump and ensure water is flowing properly in and out of the system. Now it's time to add our plants. Today we'll be planting scythe, shadow benny and thyme. The scythe that you buy in the market can often be replanted. Make some space in the growing media and insert your plants, giving them enough space to grow. Within a few weeks, you should see great results. There you go, my fellow farmers. We have now created an aquaponic system. Not only this is an affordable and innovative way to grow food, we also get to have fish. If done on a bigger scale, you'll be able to farm fish like tilapia and perch. As always, we'd love to see your project. So don't forget to send us pictures and videos of your aquaponic system. Bye!